What's up, everyone? Welcome back to Trailer Time. Mohit and Jamel here, where we wish we could have majored in trailers in college, but unfortunately, couldn't do that. We are back again to educate you on more genre specific trailers. We've done sci fi, we've done horror. Next up is comedy. There's so many great comedy trailers out there. So, so many that are good, but still, so many that are bad, but still end up being good because you find them funny. So we can't, we're going to dive into what makes a good comedy trailer, what we take out of it, and what are, one of our favorite comedy movie trailers are. Jamel, what do you got on your plate? Or do you want me to go first? Let's talk about what makes a good comedy trailer. Um, let me preface this by saying that comedy trailers in general are awful. Just terrible. Because <laughs> it's really hard to not show a movie without having with how having just put all the dialogue in there like when you put dialogue in something you're yeah. kind of showing the whole plot of the movie but you can't show a comedy trailer without showing the dialogue so it's like a catch 22 but yeah um Very some cool. people do it well um and ironically it's by going against the grain for all of the things that we typically say don't do or we're gonna mm. roast you in trailer times uh first thing <laughs> show the cast show as many funny people as you can because People are gonna go and want to see their favorite comedian, and chances are it's probably not the dude that you think is funny. Fun comedy yeah, is one of those things where like wide spectrum, all right. Um, they typically have big name actors in it. Showcase those people as much as possible. If you have Jim fucking Carrey, let Jim Carrey be in like every scene as much as possible. It's also good to pick a character's uh, a main character maybe or somebody like very important to the storyline and like show it from their perspective only. It's a good way to show a lot of like joke content without you know giving away the whole storyline of the movie, if that makes sense. Um, also, shock the audience. If you have like a, an incredibly dramatic scene that's hilarious and awful, like someone's eating poop out of a diaper with a spoon, <laughs> like you have to show that scene in the trailer. <laughs> that's disgusting, uh, but yeah, show it. <laughs> you have to, you have to. Uh, slap dick comedy. Also perfect physical comedy, all that stuff. People, Will, Will Ferrell, like falling and like breaking his leg in six pieces, like classic. Also, something that's really key is make the villain or the bad guy, the antagonist, like whatever you want to call it, make that. If that dude is bad, is hilarious too. You have a you have a great movie. <laughs> yeah. If that dude is funny, yeah, you have, you're you're golden. Absolutely. I you know, I agree. You know. Like Jamel said, there's so many bad comedy movie trailers out there. They're so one-dimensional. You gotta, you gotta use what you got, you know. So I think what I would like to look for in a comedy trailer is instead of one that goes for joke after joke after joke after joke, and utilizing all the material that should be saved for the movie, is do your best to communicate the type of humor that this movie is gonna have. So an honorable mention that I'll give away right now is The Hangover, you know. It's got that brotherhood camaraderie feeling with the jokes yeah. that you would expect to expect to experience in a if you and three of your best friends went to Vegas. You know, you really communicated the feeling, the type of humor, so the the viewer can experience what the kind of the movie is before you even go into it. On the same side, a really bad movie trailer that does the exact opposite is a trailer for the movie called The Watch. It really just sets nothing up. It uses all of its material in the trailer itself. And the movie wasn't wasn't that great. I love everyone in the in that cast. Nothing great cast. Was. The movie wasn't Bad great. Movie. So you know, focus on what the what kind of humor you're trying to communicate. Give a little uh, insight into the plot as well, so you know that it's more than just. I mean, if you want to watch something that's just joke after joke after joke, just watch a Netflix stand-up special. That's what they're there for. You got to give it what the experience is going to be like. From my experience, none of the funniest jokes in a movie or in the trailer, except for a couple. They save a lot of the good material for the movie itself. So figure out what works for you and figure out what you want to put in there, but figure out what you want to close hold to the chest, close to the chest and leave it for a surprise. With that all being said, I think my favorite comedy movie trailer that captured what I said and what Jamel said is definitely going to be 21 Jump Street. I did not expect anything from this movie. I watched the trailer maybe one time. I enjoyed it. I was like, oh, let's go see Jonah Hill, Shang Tatum. Who knew he could be a comedic actor? He literally had me on the floor crying and laughing. It was absolutely hilarious. I, so I remember funny. being in that theater so beginning funny. to oh end. Could not stop laughing. Oh, love that movie. So One funny. of my all-time favorite comedy movies. 
And like I said, honorable mention goes to The Hangover, the same thing, but I think 21 Jump Street does a better job of explaining the plot a little more and give us a, giving us an actual movie experience in that way. Final honorable mention that I will say, uh, not to a movie trailer, but specifically to Will Ferrell in the trailer for the movie Old School. He was at every scene he was in that trailer. So gold, good. gold, so good. gold. So good. Let me give an honorable mention also to Kicking and Screaming, Will Ferrell. <laughs> Will Ferrell. Uh, that was so funny. I just, it's it's so dumb funny. comedy, but like yeah. perfect type. Also, uh, the other guys. I mean, like we talked Will about Ferrell. it before, but like, damn, dude, Will Ferrell needs his his flowers today, guys. Uh, yeah. The best, yeah. my favorite. I'm not gonna say the best anymore. My favorite <laughs> uh, comedy trailer is definitely "This Is the End." Like oh. that Jonah Hill, dude. Jonah Hill, amazing. <laughs> Too bad, <laughs> awesome. Uh, but like, dude, the, the when he's like possessed, even like who his character is before, like with Michael, Michael Sarah, so hilarious. Like the movie was hilarious. The, they gave me the whole cast that you could have wanted in any kind of like comedy movie. I don't know Absolutely. how they did it to this day. So people yeah. definitely work for free. Like I have no idea how. They have happened. to, dude. There's, uh, there's, there's so many people. Cast. How'd they get Rihanna? Or Emma I'm, Watson? Dude, what the fuck? How? They got Emma Watson. <laughs> How do they afford this? Yeah. Love that. Kudos to them. Great trailer. Yeah, I completely agree. Great trailer. I remember watching that trailer and wanting to watch that movie the next freaking day. Like So bad. I was like, this is going to be phenomenal. Yeah. And it, it lived up to the hype the movie did. It lived up to the trailer. Uh, well, there you have everyone. 21 Jump Street. This is the end. Both phenomenal movies. Both phenomenal trailers in their own right. Um, let us know what you thought in the comments below. What do you think really belongs in a comedy movie trailer? Do you agree with the points we made? Do you completely disagree? Are we just stupid? Don't know what we're talking about? That could be so. Let us know. Probably that. We'd love to hear from you. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I forgot to say in the beginning of the video, so I'm saying it again. Now, like, share, and subscribe. Hit that bell icon twice if you have to. Actually, three times. If you hit it twice, you went to like it. So three times. Thanks again for tuning in. We love you guys. We love talking about trailers. So catch us again next time where we're going to talk about all things trailers. Peace.